Cybertron, our home. For generations, it has been a peaceful world until pride and a lust for power divided us. Now we fight enemies who were once our brothers. Cybertron. It is a necessary war to return us to glory. The Autobots will never sacrifice freedom. The Decepticons will bring this world to order. Our defeat would mean the end of everything. My victory will mark a brilliant new beginning! One shall stand. One shall fall. Cybertron, homeworld to the Transformers for millions of years. Megatron, leader of the Decepticons, recently discovered an ancient power that will give him the edge to win over the hated Autobots. Called Dark Energon, this power remains locked away in an orbital station under the protection of a Sky Commander named Starscream. with such desperation if the legends weren't true. Lord Megatron, you're certain it's here? I am certain, Barricade. And when I find it, the balance of this war with the Autobots will finally tip in my favor. Lord Megatron, stabilizers are failing. Maintain your heading, Brawl. Do not falter. Sublight engines are offline. Shields at 15%. Reroute all power to forward guns and thrusters. Full speed ahead. But, sir, that's suicide! Any further objections? Ram this warship straight into the heart of that station! Dark Energon is mine to command! Through my will alone shall Cybertron be restored. It's too unstable, Megatron. Using that power, you're endangering our entire world. Teach me, Megatron. Teach me to wield Dark Energon the way you do, and I will serve you. And what could you possibly offer me that I cannot simply take? The supply of Dark Energon aboard this station is nearly exhausted. I know how to manufacture more. There was once an Energon bridge that fed this station directly. I know how to reconnect it. Stryker! Sator Prime will hear about this! <laughs> Shall I send Thundercracker and Skywarp to retrieve him, Lord Megatron? No. I want the Autobots' leader to know his doom approaches. Once we have this station online, nothing can stop me. Now go! 
Find this Energon Bridge and reactivate it for your new master. Anxious to prove themselves worthy of the Decepticon name, Starscream and his minions fly to Cybertron. There, they must reconnect the Energon Bridge that will enable Megatron to manufacture more Dark Energon and conquer the Autobots once and for all. Now I can introduce Dark Energon into the planet's core, and as it spreads throughout Cybertron, my power shall travel with it. Entrance to the planet core is heavily shielded behind the Omega Gate. I will acquire the key. We launch a full-scale assault on Iacon immediately, and wipe Zeta Prime and his pathetic Autobots off the face of the planet! Hungry for more power, Megatron plans to corrupt the very core of Cybertron itself with Dark Energon. But to do so, he must first find the Omega Key, which will unlock the gateway to the core. Megatron launches a full-scale assault on Iacon, capital city of the Autobots, where the key is protected by Zeta Prime, leader of the Autobots. Cybertron is mine! <laughs> Your spies were misinformed, Megatron. That device only activates the key to the core. But don't worry, the Omega key will come to you. Omega activated. Power optimal. Mission. Destroy Megatron! Zeta Prime is conquered, but the device Megatron believed to be the Omega Key simply activated the key. Omega Supreme. Megatron quickly discovers he can use the device to track Omega Supreme and races above the skies of Iacon in pursuit of his quarry. The great Omega Supreme is vulnerable. Megatron and his Decepticons must press their attack if they hope to overcome the Guardian of Iacon and force him to unlock the gateway to Cybertron's core. Omega Supreme has fallen, corrupted by the influence of Dark Energon. Triumphant, Megatron forces the Guardian to open the Omega Gate and lead the Decepticons to the core of Cybertron itself. At last, the core of Cybertron is mine! Are the Corruptors in place? Yes, Lord Megatron. Then let it begin! A glorious new age is upon us, my brethren. With Dark Energon infused into the core, Cybertron is mine to command! <laughs> 
Viacon, the capital city of the Autobots, is crumbling under the onslaught of Megatron and his Decepticons. Rumors have spread of the defeat of Omega Supreme and Autobot leader Zeta Prime. If the Autobots have any hope to band together and repel the enemy, a new hero must emerge. shouldn't be out here alone. Autobots are no longer safe in Iacon. The Decepticons control the airwaves. The only secure way to communicate is by messenger. I volunteered. Name's Bumblebee. Ratchet, this Autobot needs repairs. Be still. I'll get you fixed up. What? No, there's no time! I need to find the Autobot called Optimus. I have important information for him. I am Optimus. You're... Sir, it pains me to tell you this. But our leader, Zeta Prime, is dead. Megatron. What of the High Council? They've gone into hiding, cut all communication with the outside. Optimus, with Zeta Prime gone, our forces are directionless, ineffective. The Council will emerge when it's safer. In the meantime, Ratchet Bumblebee, you're with me. Again, all the bots. That's a promise. Run, you yellow-plated coward! Good work, Autobots. Now let's coordinate the city's defenses. To anyone receiving this broadcast, this is Zeta Prime. I am being held captive in Megatron's Kaon Prison Complex. Prime is alive. Ratchet, home in on that signal and boost it. On it! I am downloading vital information that could help the Autobots win the war. Hurry, Autobots. I don't know how much longer I have. Optimus, let's go! We have to save Zeta Prime! That wasn't Zeta Prime, Optimus. It couldn't be. The message carried his unique data signature, Ratchet. Perhaps, but we both saw the wreckage of what Megatron did to him. No one could survive that. Even if there is the smallest possibility that Zeta is alive, we must act. Optimus, it's a trap. Surely you see that. A chance we'll have to take. Hang on, Zeta, my friend. I have a plan. In an effort to save Zeta Prime, Optimus enacts a bold plan to allow himself and a few others to be captured by the Decepticons. The plan works all too well, and soon the Autobots find themselves en route to Kaon, the capital city of the Decepticons. High Council, I return with a fallen hero. Till all are one. Times have grown desperate. The Autobots crave your guidance. The Council exists only to choose the Primes. It is the Primes' directive to lead and protect. There are no Primes. Even now, you still reject your calling. For too long have we watched the other Primes fall to their pride and greed. But you, Optimus, your courage and wisdom have transformed the lives around you. Megatron has infected the very core of our world. You must journey to the core and remove this blight. Failure would doom us all. I will accept the burden with all that I am. Rise, Optimus Prime, for you are the leader of the Autobots. You are the last Prime. <laughs> 
Having embraced his destiny as leader of the Autobots, Optimus Prime leads a small band of Autobots to save the core of Cybertron itself from the clutches of Megatron. But to do so, they must first rescue the mightiest Autobot Guardian ever created, Omega Supreme. Optimus Prime, you have delivered me from the foul influence of Dark Energon, but I am afraid my spark is corrupted. We're too late. I can survive if I shut down my systems completely. But the process will take millions of years, during which Cybertron will be left cold and barren. We must leave our home if we are to survive. The line of crimes has failed, yet hope still remains. I offer a portion of my spark to take with you to the stars. For as long as it survives, so shall I. Will you accept this responsibility, Optimus Prime? I will. Behold, the Matrix of Leadership. Cybertron recognizes and welcomes Optimus Prime. Keeper of the Matrix. Leader of the Free Autobots. The core is too damaged by Dark Energon to sustain life on Cybertron. In order to repair itself, the core must shut down for millions of years. Carrying the power of the Matrix of Leadership inside him, Optimus Prime must sadly order the evacuation of the entire planet if the race of Transformers is to survive. To all Autobots within range of this signal, our planet is dying. We have no choice but to take to the stars I am ordering the evacuation of all Autobot cities, effective immediately. What was that? I told you, to stay and defy me was to die, and no one defies Megatron. He's insane. Silverbolt, ready your soldiers. We need that gun offline now. Cannon is offline, but has revealed its true form to be none other than a savage monster named Trypticon. It races to the planet's surface like a meteor, hungry to enact revenge on the Autobots. Trypticon is defeated, but the victory is bittersweet. Optimus and the others watch as their brothers evacuate the planet in the galactic transports. You did it, Prime. We did it, Ratchet. All of us. Many brothers were lost today, but thanks to our combined efforts, many more will live to find a home elsewhere. Optimus, Megatron is still out there. And as long as we remain here, we shall resist him. But in time, our turn will come to leave Cybertron as well. I have commissioned a new galactic transport for us, an Ark, in which we shall make our journey through the stars. No matter where we go, Cybertron will be with us. <laughs> 